hey guys in this video we are going to build an about form so by the end of this video you will learn how to create something like this so this is our main form and if I click on the about button a new form pop-ups and then we have this text which doesn't mean anything right now but you can imagine this like an about dialogue as it says right here <laughs> anyways and if I click ok that form disappears and actually closes and if I click about again the same thing happens so the goal of this video is to learn how to create new forms except for the one we are working already and then weaving them through the main form so this process is going to be very much easy and also it will be very useful because it is like if we go to help and click on about Microsoft Visual C++ Express <laughs> it gives us this new form so um, actually as you can see it is really useful so by the end of this video we will create that I mean pretty awesome right so without any further ado let's get started so we'll start by creating a new project so I have this empty form with nothing in it so what I'm gonna do is I will go to the toolbox and grab a button and put it over here and I will go to properties and I will change its text to about and I will increase its size with some customizations and next what we need to do is we need to add the new form so to do that you can go to solution explorer and right click on the project so in this case in this case it's about dialogue tutorial and right click on it and go to add and click on add new item then from here choose windows form and give it a name I'll just type about now you can see that the new form has appeared so this is the about dialog and this is our main form so it is form 1 and this is about so next I'm going to the toolbox and I will grab a text box and place it over here and then I will make it multi-line and I will make it a little bit large like this and I will go to properties and paste some text in there so this is some random text uh, I mean you can put whatever you need there uh, and next I'll go to the toolbox and grab a button and put it here just like we did earlier we will change its text to ok not about this time ok this time uh, this is the ok button which we are going to use to uh, exceed this form so this is our about dialog and this is the main form so these are the two now we are going to link them using the code so I'll just save everything and then I will go to this forms source code by right clicking on it and clicking on view code from here I will include the new header file so to do that I can type include and inside quotations I will include the about.h file which you can find over here this guy so after including that we can use that to create a new instance of this form so if we go to the code of this form the class is about so we can use this class and create a new ob object and then use that object to view a new instance of this form so I will go to the code of this one actually I will go to the design and then I will double click on this button to create the event handler and then I will type about and then put this weird sign and then I will type a name so I will type about form equals gc new about so now that we created our object we can use it so I will type about form arrow show so now this code will be able to display the new form that we created just right now so if I run the program by pressing F5 and if I click on the about button we should get that about form but right now if we click on ok it does nothing and that step is pretty simple uh, so I will just close these two and then I will go to about.hdesign and then I will double click on the ok button and then type 
form double colon close remember earlier when we needed to close the application we typed application double colon exit but for now we just want to close the form so we are typing form double colon close and also there's one more thing that we need to do i will so i will show it to you just in a minute so right now i will run the program and if i click on about as you can see we have the about dialog and if i click ok the about dialog goes and if i click here it seems like i can work on both forms about forms don't work that way when they are open you can't work on the main form so what we need to do is consider this about form as a dialog so let's go to form1.h and without just showing i will type show dialog and if i press f5 now let's see what happens if i click about now and the about dialog pop ups and if i try to click on the form form 1 the main form i can't click on it because this is the active form and this is not until i click ok i can't do anything but after i click it i can come back to the form so that's it for this video if you haven't watched the previous video about message boxes i highly recommend watching it because it has some things to do with this one actually not but you know it is pretty important anyways this one also looks like message boxes if you can remember message boxes were just the same but without so much properties just just the icon the message the title and the buttons but in this case we can design our own message boxes even you learned something new something useful and something meaningful today hope you guys understood it so let's meet you in the next video until then hit subscribe like comment share and bye for now